For the West Denton Tech softball team on Monday, a meeting with one of the top teams in the area meant a chance to build on the best start in team history and to make a race of the Burlington County Scholastic League's Patriot Division. Unfortunately, it couldn't have come at a worse time. Our number one pitcher and our number two pitcher went down, and my number three pitcher had the pitch today. And most teams don't even have three pitchers to even throw out there. And the biggest hit they got off of her was a double. Burlington Township had 16 hits, including four in a five-run first inning, which cleared a path for the Falcons to capitalize on their opportunity and clinch at least a tie for their second straight Patriot Division title. Sophomore pitcher Bailey Enoch pitched a five-inning no-hitter and took care of her part on offense as well. I don't even pay attention to it anymore because once my team tells me, then I know it's going to get into the back of my head and I'm not going to do as good. So it was good that I don't know. I think just I just need to get three outs in the inning. Really, I try not to think at all. My screw kind of uh, rose a little, so they kept baiting after that, they kept swinging. We just worked in and out, both sides of the plate, and it was good. Enoch had three hits, including a double, to back her own cause. Caitlin Henry, number 17, also had three hits, and the Falcons got two each from number four, Cassie Hessen, and sophomore right fielder Anaya Hunt. My at-bats weren't as I, what I hoped they were. Like, they were hitting off the end of the bat, and I have to hit on the barrel, but I could always work on that. Hunt's two-run single put the Falcons up 11-0 in the third inning. Having a big, comfortable lead, though, didn't keep her from turning in the best defensive play of the game in the fifth. I saw that the ball was, like, landing short, and I've been waiting all season to die for the ball, so I thought I should, and it turned out great. The Falcons beat West Hampton Tech 14-0, they can clinch the Patriot outright on Tuesday with a win at home against Del Ram. They work really hard. Uh, you know, I, I will definitely say the advantage we have, uh, everybody in the lineup, um, they're all returners. So early in March, we, you know, we jumped right back in where we left off and we just kept our momentum going from there and that's definitely made a big difference. From West Hampton Tech, this is John Lewis.